Take your time and look around. Uh, let's go for the one shiny thing that has a color palette that isn't like everything else here. Oh, it's a music box. And it looks like the uh, the music's starting to loop here, so I'm gonna go ahead and continue talking. It looks like we are definitely in a flashback here. He is asleep. Are you leaving again so soon, dear? And unfortunately, I cannot move the uh, the dialogue forward in this scene. It looks like. No, I haven't had a seizure for some time now. I hope we can live together as a family forever. Wait, that's Stella? I thought you said Bart said that she died as soon as he was born or short after. He looks like six or seven now. I know, but get some sleep. You need the rest. I will, but I have one more job to do before that. I don't know what she's off to do. But she needed to do that off screen, apparently. So, Dad wants to come talk to us. You're leaving again, aren't you? You were awake, huh? Of course, I always overhear your passive-aggressive arguments, I guess you could say. Going to get more bad guys? That's what I do. I'm a badass. Please, take me too. I'm a ninja now. Totally. I throw things. No, you, you stay with your mother. Don't tell her where I went. She'll only get pissed at me. Okay. Oh, the music's starting to wear down here. Now go to sleep. Stella, you get some rest too. Stella? Uh oh. What? Oh, that doesn't look good. Looks like she had her seizures again. I don't think she's gonna make it. Stella! You have to. You have to do the streetcar named Desire reference there, don't you? Well, a streetcar named Desire, but you have to do it. What do you have to say about me sitting in the corner of the house and just having a huge nostalgia gasm over there? Nice melody, isn't it? You being here brings to mind a poem. Here, this is for you and your memories. And we've learned Temptation Song, which is the second song that we have learned that we could use as a bard. I have not been using a bard. I will not use a bard for a little bit of time here. Because, to be honest, I'm not a big fan of it. Um, especially, with though, when we only have one or two songs to choose from. Do you have anything new at the magic shop for me? Uh, no. If I had picked that... If I didn't pick that up in... Um, I believe that we got that out of the castle. You could get that now. Asuna is always useful. Should you get any sort of status effect on you that you need to cure. Which is, you know, most status effects. I'm not a big fan of this building right here, and it doesn't look like they are going to let me in, actually. How do you get into your house, scholar? No wonder he's a scholar. It just it took that kind of mental capacity to get into his house. Uh, down here we can find the item shop. Once again, no upgraded items pretty much ever. So I don't need anything out of the item shop because I haven't used very much. Uh, Guild here uh, sells weapons, it looks like. Purely for the ninja? Holy crap. I don't think anybody else can equip the ninja knife. Shuriken, fire skill, water skill, and lightning skill are all thrown items. So, I mean, we are talking about a pure ninja salesman right here and to be honest i have no need for any of those not a single one anything from you green beret and a ninja suit i do probably need how many of these do i have i have a spare ninja suit but i do not have a spare green beret so i'm going to buy a green beret and i assume that's going to be an upgrade for reina now that she is a trainer Go ahead and upgrade her there. It is plus one to vigor, speed, and defense. Always nice. Always nice. 
now let's just head out of here and I do believe that we are actually done here in the village of Rick's Rick's village always sound weird to me it sounds like it's owned by a guy named Rick but we are done here now let's get back into our airship and I believe the fastest way would be to go east it is to the east now we have made it to our next destination this is actually on the northwest corner of the map, but it's still called Easterly Village. I, I don't understand. I don't understand. I'm just a humble shepherd. Good, good for you. How you guys doing? We've seen a big waterfall east of here. They're called Easterly Falls. Pretty nice, huh? It is. The last quake took out the road to the falls entirely. Of course. Luckily, I have an airship to get over that. Sure. Airships for everybody. Well, no, just for me, actually. I found something cool in the flower bed over there. What flower bed? This one? Can I can I look at it? I want... Yeah. Get out of my way! I wanted to look at flower beds. Uh, uh, no, no, no. You lie. Little girls lie all the time. I uh, don't believe I can go up that way, so let's just talk to the people over here. Yes. I have spoken with them. Ooh, another magic shop. There's a monster wandering around the eastern woods dressed like an old man. and He'll hit you like a thunderclap. That's probably not good. I'm not a big fan of thunderclaps. Do we have any new magic in the magic shop? Demi. Uh, no? Really? All this time magic? And I've already obtained it all, apparently. Should probably be using regen more regions usually overpowered in these kinds of games just uh, obscene amount of healing done constantly what's up little girl better not talk to the sheep in the left corner of this town they'll ram you as soon as you look at you whoa what? that's probably not the sheep she meant don't scare me like that i was just pretending to be a trainer and then she runs off and i don't know where she went uh, Anything to say? No. What about if I approach you from behind? And smack that sheep's ass. And I just got kicked. No means no. You try... Yes, we are trying to save the crystal. How did you know? Then here's a song that should help you. In a flash, we have learned how to play the song. If only learning real songs was that easy. Soothes the savage beast, and monsters like it too. That's just gross what you said. Now it's time to get back. Hmm. If I remember right, I gotta go like a convoluted path to get back to where I need to go. Something hidden behind the waterfall, at least that's what great great grandma said. Get out of my way. I'm trying to head this way and that just leads out of town. So I guess let's just head back in through the front. Anything in these flower beds? I was told there was something in one of the flower beds. However, I cannot get to most of them. No, I can't even... Oh, I can get over to these ones here. Anything this way? It looks like there should be a path there, but there's definitely not. Little girl and their lies. Do we have anything new at the armor shop? Get out of my way, please. Armor shop. Relics. Holy crap, we have some good stuff here. Fire ring, coal ring, angel ring. I can't afford any of it, and I seriously doubt you can either, so I'm not, I don't even want to tell you what they do, but I think you guys can figure it out, or at least a hint of what they do. What are you doing? Fire rings absorb flames, protecting against the cold, bear weak against water. Coal rings absorb water, protecting against fire, bear weak against lightning. Angel rings protect against zombie and aging spells. So... So much for me not telling you, he told you. Can I sleep in your bed? Freaking spoiler-tastic guy over here. There's no way anybody can be able to afford those at this point in the game. What's up, dude? That frog's still sleeping even though it's warm out. Anything in these flower beds? Hey. A frog's in there. What the hell are you doing, froggy? What the hell? The frog dropped a toad spell, and that's how you learn toad. Freaking flower bed trick. 
<laughs> oh god. I believe that is still a black magic. It is. Level 2, you can turn people into toads. Works very similar to the last games. Uh, they pretty much can't do anything except cast toad. It's a very nice spell if you can pull it off. A lot of enemies are immune to it, though. A lot of them are immune to it. Uh, I believe that is pretty much it. No, th there's got to be more here. So, actually, I know there is more, so let me just uh, save outside of town and I'll be right back. I knew there was something important here, but it is not in town. We need to actually get into a fight outside of town. Now, they kind of give it away here that there is an old man out in the forest who will hit you with a thunderclap. And it looks like we have gotten him. We're up against Rama. It is technically boss time because, as I'm sure many Final Fantasy fans will know, this is quite an important character that we have here. We can get a we can get a potion off of him. I have switched Ferris over to using blue magic because I believe Aqua Rake is my best friend here. Go Aqua Rake. 568 better than what else I could be using. Let's go for Shiva as well because they gave me a free attack because I had a first strike. Go Diamond Dust. 231. Not that great, but better than nothing. This guy is bulky to say the least. Um, Bolt 2 is going to be something you hate, as I'm sure you have, can figure out. 168. Uh, that is not what I wanted to do. We're going to go for Ice 2 to try to preserve a little bit of uh, magic here. Because Aqua Rig is not doing as much as I thought, and Ice 2 is working good enough. Cure 2 across the board. I'm probably going to need to do that a little bit more than I would like, because it looks like that one cure is not going to be enough to prevent them from dying to another bolt too. Now if you could not hit him with the shock after the whip, that would be appreciated. Thank you for not killing Reyna. She after all is healing you on occasion. Let's go for another ice too. Uh, so just the one aqua rig should be enough and then I should be able to use ice too all the rest of the way. Uh, now he is not particularly weak to anything. It looks like otherwise he would have had more damage done to him with the Aqua Rake. Uh, however, if you do have anything that can use uh, Bolt, uh, particularly Asper, how dare you, sir? How dare you? Damn it. Particularly the Shock Whip with the Coral Sword. Uh, Shock Whip's not that bad, but the Coral Sword is particularly bad. Those both deal lightning damage. Do not use them here. Unequip them, bring something else. Or if you have a mod and can unequip them, just don't attack. <laughs> this is my best uh, best advice to you. Let's go ahead and go for another cure. Like I said, I'll be doing that more often than I would like. Just to be safe. Because it's always better to be safe than to have somebody die. You cannot catch Rama. <laughs> don't even bother. 162 and 99. Still not enough for the victory. We've got to be getting pretty close here. I don't believe he is weak to any status effects here, unfortunately. Oh, Ifrit. Just who are you? Rama. Your skills have improved. If there only there was a way. Don't say it, Ifrit. We are friends, aren't we? And... Down goes Rama! Yes, you get three ability points, and that is it for this. Surely, you don't get anything else out of this. Oh wait, you get Rama! You can now summon him in battle. He is another summon. Very nice to have. Now it is time for me to heal back at the inn, and we will go to our next destination next time. That's going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy V. I've been joined, as always, by my side questing squad of Bart, Raina, Gallif, and Ferris. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.